calling your energy back. If you're going to disconnect from the outer world, you have to learn how to change your brain waves. So let's talk about brain wave frequencies for a moment. Most of the time that you are awake and conscious, you are in a beta range of brain wave frequencies. Beta is measured in low range, medium range, and high range frequencies. Low range beta is a relaxed state when you don't perceive any threats from the outer world, but you are still aware of your body in space and time. This is the state you are in when you are reading, paying attention to your daughter during a friendly conversation or listening to a lecture. Mid-range beta is a slightly more aroused state, such as when you are in a group of people introducing yourself to everyone for the first time and you have to remember everyone's name. You're more vigilant, but you're not overly stressed or completely out of balance. Think of mid-range beta as good stress. High-range beta is a state you're in when you're jacked up on the hormones of stress. These are the brain waves you display when you exhibit any of the survival emotions, including anger, alarm, agitation, suffering, grief, anxiety, frustration, or even depression. High range beta can be more than three times higher than low range beta and twice as high as mid range beta. While you may spend most of your waking time in beta frequency brain waves, you also dip into alpha frequency brain waves throughout your day. You display alpha brain waves when you are relaxed calm, creative, and even intuitive. When you're no longer thinking or analyzing and instead you're daydreaming or imagining, like a trance state. If beta brain waves indicate when you are placing the majority of your attention on your outer world, alpha brain waves indicate when you are placing more of your attention on your inner world. Theta frequency brain waves take over in a twilight stage, when your mind is still awake but your body is drifting off to sleep. This frequency is also associated with deep states of meditation. Delta frequency brain waves usually come during deep restorative sleep. However, over the last four years, my research team and I have recorded several students who can move into very deep delta brain waves during meditation. Their bodies are deeply asleep and they are not dreaming, but their brain scan shows that their brains are processing very high amplitudes of energy. As a result, they report having profound mystical experiences of oneness, feeling connected to everyone and everything in the universe. See figure 2.7 to compare the different brainwave states. Gamma brain waves indicate what I call a superconscious state. This high frequency energy occurs when the brain gets aroused from the internal event. One of the most common examples is during meditation when your eyes are closed and you are going within. Instead of an event that happens outside the body, we'll talk more about the gamma brain waves in a later chapter. 2.7 showing all the brain waves in order from beta, alpha, theta, delta, and gamma, a comparison of different brain waves.